so Apple added plenty of new features to its second generation iPhone, including a faster internet connection and GPS capabilities. But one thing's been dropped the price. But of course, the big news is $399. To 199. The 8 gigabyte model will sell for 199. A 16 gig model will cost 299. Analysts say Apple needed to slash the gadget's price and upgrade it to hit the company's target of selling 10 million iPhones by the end of the year. That's really aggressive when you think that the first iPhone at the high end cost 599. Apple is very clearly making a statement here today that they want to make a, a serious push and really boost market share. But it'll cost more to use the new iPhone. AT&T, the exclusive carrier for the phone, will charge users about $10 more per month. They will get unlimited access to new applications like music making software, next generation video games, real time sports scoreboards, and on demand news video. Apple has inked deals in 70 countries to carry the new iPhone. Next time you're in Malta and you need an iPhone 3G, it'll be there for you. The new iPhone goes on sale July 11th. Haven Daily, The Associated Press, San Francisco.